Hello and welcome. Uh, today I'm presenting one new thing in my uh, shop and uh, this thing and again uh, I'm going to present a new method of uh, uh, buying my things and paying uh, at the end of the video. I have finally found a way out for those who want to pay directly want to pay paypal cheaper than on etsy and uh, without any sales tax a bit later so this is a brand new uh, collection i have only made one set and this set is for seasonal journals uh, this is a collection of uh, three mini um lab book journals that uh, are assigned to different months of summer this one is for june this one is for july and this one is for august um, as you can see i uh, couldn't stop so i i am going to sell them um, as one set as one lot as one item and uh, so as you can see these are uh, first of all, these are the, uh, the the covers, soft covers of different botanical books, and I just, uh, <laughs> they are not very thick, but they are so nice, I uh, couldn't help, um, like, uh, repurposing them into something else. First one says June, it's covered, uh, it's closed with this ribbon, uh, this ribbon comes from Norway, from one of my uh, virtual junk journal friends artists and uh, so you can see it, it was in her happy mail thank you for that so that's the first and then i uh, fix it with this pin matching the color i'll fix it right now like this not to lose it but then i'll do it after the video so uh, this one uh, is uh, made from the book Plants and Health, Rastenie i Zdorovie in Russian, and also it has some flips, um, flips with, uh, yeah, the books are really authentic, very pretty old, uh, all of them, uh, I'm not sure about vintage, but the retro for sure, all of them from the previous century, all of them in Russian. So this is a tag and this is an assortment of different uh, word tags that you can cut and um, fix wherever. And one more tiny, tiny pocket that says summertime and the envelope from uh, the Soviet Union, 90 something or 20 something, yeah, just don't remember. Yeah, maybe 90. So, and I used their a lot of pages from different botanical books on medicinal plants and just on different plants and uh, some coffee dyed paper good for writing and drawing and sketching uh, let me make a quick flip through some some stickers Again, another page from a book with descriptions and weeds, and you know, um, they they even the picture of the roots and the seeds, and just really, really amazing pictures, I would say. Oh, this one is uh, like about one of my wild plants that I keep keep adding to different journals, like the blue one. Some more illustrations a lot as you can see there are a lot of botanical pages original with illustrations i didn't cover them with anything because who knows maybe you like drawing um, on top of uh, book pages because it also gives very nice effect especially if you draw with uh, paintings sorry with paints or with uh, uh, color pencils or even a sketching just sketching and some more pages, some more pages. It's only one signature, but it's pretty thick. And now you can see uh, another flip here. Yeah, and first of all, some pockets, right? Pockets with tags. And one more pocket with another tag. Two tags even. 
all of them are clean because this is for journaling not just to look at that but also to journal actively here is uh, the set where you can put your photos and uh, one more flip where you can put any tag another pocket with some labels uh, and cards that can be used and somehow all of them refer to the summer topic and one more flip with an envelope and some more cards and tags here so this one is for june um okay then let's move to july another book with some more pictures and nice plants also i kept uh, where i could i kept the spine i covered it with uh, masking tape with many levels layers of masking tape where i couldn't preserve it or uh, uh, the, the second method was putting like this on top of masking tape so you can still see them so they are differently made okay this one has a different structure construction oh yeah i forgot to tell you to mention that uh, i picked different calendar pages that i have uh to for 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 the uh, for this exact month i mean uh, for july 2021 not all of them i mean i don't you don't have all the days here but the majority so that you could put them uh, and use it as a diary um, like you can put it like this is the first so you can put it here and write something about the first and also you can write even here so the point is this is a glassing uh, pocket because i wanted to leave uh, visible this uh, uh, amazing illustrations on the inside of the cover and some more pages the principle is the same as in the first journal pictures plants pictures and uh, some stickers some decorations this one as you remember is uh, the picture that can be also colored you can by the way color these illustrations as well or you can sketch stamp draw your own and uh, this is the second part of the signature i put it inside into the folder into this flip because uh, the flip is given uh, like a pretty thick um, binding mm. I forgot how to, to, to call it and this one is about the back side of this particular book it's nice absolutely beautiful as you can see and uh, uh, as well to preserve these illustrations i used only a glassine bag and um, some envelope with some actually these are graphic 45 by the way, I used some tags from Graphic 45, this one and this one are also from Graphic 45 and sticker. And this is an original book pocket uh, from the library. Oh, spine. Yeah. And the last one is for August. It's pretty thick. And this one is, uh, it's, it's called about like in Russian, it's wild fruit and berries and it's about uh, the things that you can pick in the forest or you can pick in the meadows and that are not uh, somehow cultivated or something this is the front page of this book as well and another flip um, wait a second yeah this one so the flip is also made into a pocket with a clean tag this guy this is uh, by the way all, all the majority of uh, photo mats here are from dcwv collections of uh, like um, pad paper and some tags 
and this one says country life and this is uh, th this is the card from prima some more tag and this is actually uh, um, an envelope with some tags yeah it's okay it looked strange and some more tags some more tags nature is the art of god life without dreams is like a garden without flowers and this one is about the hazelnut tree okay and uh oh yeah that's not all then this flip also opens up and you can see this nice again assortment this is a frame this is a frame and you can off also from graphic 45 okay and uh, this is an envelope with some illustration and one more pocket this one this pocket is from prima cards and one more pocket also a uh, pretty versatile i'll fit, fit it next uh, a bit later not to waste your time this is the main part and uh, also kind of a pocket and also some tags that you can put here and uh, here we are here comes the pager the pages part the signature uh, pretty much the same principle stickers botanical in illustrations book pages everything you can this one i even started to color once and uh, left it unfinished as this one is for august i used uh, mushroom stickers and I, I can see i didn't stick it pretty well now you, you know when the light is uh, falling at a special angle it's visible okay and here yes uh, different plans and so on and here is the collection of also calendar pages for different days and tags actually this part is common for all the journals all the three so this is it and this is mm, the whole collection that i have now uh, i'm not going to make one more because uh, the summer is over here and uh, makes no sense maybe if only for some special separate month i have one more book like this but uh, uh, it's not here i haven't yet thought what to make it into maybe just one summer journal or something so these three will come as a set uh, into two places the first place will be itsy uh, but i have as i told you I was going, I was planning to find something and I found something. Um, I have already been using it and it works perfectly well. It's pretty safe for you and for me. Um, this is kind of, uh, I managed to uh, set up kind of a shop where I can now sell my goods directly to you. Yes, I do have to pay, pay fees, but I uh, had uh, to pay even more. Uh, when I when I worked with Etsy, I pay twice as much as uh, I'm going to pay with this shop, and um, uh, that's why I'm going to post the direct link to this item and to the payment. Payment is via PayPal. Pretty comfortable for all of you, I guess. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to put this link uh, below in the description box and um, uh, but i still will list it on etsy for those who feel more comfortable but as etsy is very um, like is less user friendly for many of us and it's still blo and it started blocking a lot of accounts and a lot of uh, citizens of other countries rather than usa and probably european union I haven't heard it from them, but I don't communicate with uh, the artists from European Union. That's why I don't know whether they, they experience any issues or not. 
So uh, the listing, this listing on Etsy will be ex more expensive because uh, Etsy takes about uh, like 20 bucks, uh, $20 uh, in different uh, fees for um, things like this. And um, uh, moreover, uh, if you come from the USA or many other European countries, you will have to pay a sales tax, which is even more. If you, that's why I would definitely suggest uh, um, considering uh, my 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 first link to the different shop, and I am going to sell there. Uh, it's going to be listed there cheaper. Than on Etsy, that's for sure, and with no sales tax, and uh, it works just the same way. I'm gonna send you the uh, well, definitely. If you know me, I don't think you have any any doubts that I can can be honest or something. If you don't know me, that might be an issue, definitely. But uh, so my promises, <laughs> they mean nothing. But at least I know that I am going to provide you with the, um, um, sorry, let me say, uh, I'm going to provide you with the tracking number of your parcel, because it's also required in the system I'm using now, more than that. But I would also ask you to write to me directly that you are you have bought it uh, just in case, because uh, I usually know people who buy from this with this system. I usually send them these links directly. And um, you can get in touch with me via, uh, either on Instagram, uh, direct messengers, uh, messages, on Facebook uh, or even here in the comment section, we'll just get in touch. Um, one, one, one more piece of news, which is, you know, it's even not surprising, but uh, things are coming this way and they have been coming this way for many, for just a couple of uh, months so far and for many years they have been preparing. I mean that uh, Russian government I come from Belarus, but uh, Russian government influences politics, uh, financial politics as well, a lot. And that's why policy, sorry. That's why uh, everything that refers to Russia can somehow influence my country as well. Unluckily, unfortunately, but this is life. So I uh, found out that um, Russian government is uh, now considering the question of blocking YouTube in Russia. And uh, same will probably refer to our country as well. Mm, and who knows, maybe they will be able even to do the same with Facebook or something. So in case they block YouTube, um, I will upload videos on Facebook. I hope it's possible. I mean, the flip throughs and uh, different probably tutorials. Um, so if you have been planning, I'm not sure whether it will happen or not, but uh, in the crazy times like this, you can never be uh, sure of anything. That's why if you have ever thought that I have ever been planning to watch something from my videos, just uh, try some projects or ideas out to that now, because who knows, maybe one day we all will get access to this particular content of my um, of my channel. On the other hand, if they block it, it doesn't mean that my channel will disappear. It means that I will be unable to to use YouTube. That's all. So it sounds crazy. It sounds like Orwell stories, but this is, I guess, Orwell stories are not that crazy. So thank you so much for watching. Again, uh, all the links are down below the video. If you have any questions or if you have any ideas, feel free to write in the comment section. Um, I always answer the comments. And uh, thank you so much. See you soon, hopefully. And bye-bye. Uh,